The sugar industry remains a high priority strategic sector for national agro-industrial development, wealth and employment creation. However, our production is chronically at deficit with productivity plagued by aging mills, high indebtedness of sector institutions, diminishing soil facility, competition for land, low uptake of research variety of cane, low use of fertilizer, among other challenges. Local and international shortage of sugar has pushed the prices of the commodity beyond the reach of many households, underscoring the urgent need for a comprehensive transformation of the sector. This is why the government of Kenya has embarked on interventions to deliver conclusive resolution of the problems undermining the sector's potential. To begin with, the cabinet has approved the write-off of Kenya Shillings 117 billion of debt owed to state-owned sugar mills and companies in preparation for the leasing of the mills to private investors. The aim of the intervention is to inject competitiveness to the sector and ensure that at the expiry of the leases, the land reverts back to communities under a cooperative model. We have also been not afraid and neither have we hesitated to take difficult decisions to restore sanity in the sugar sector. Regulatory reforms are being undertaken to empower farmers and give stakeholders a say in the affairs of the sugar industry. We remain vigilant and shall closely monitor progress to ensure that government decisions to advance the interests of the sugar growers and consumers are fully implemented in a timely fashion. The conversation we have initiated with leaders from the sugar belt will be sustained until we find a lasting solution to the chronic challenges that have brought the sector to its knees and impoverished thousands of hard-working farming households.